Tide Badminton enjoyed a revival a few years ago, and the rising trend looks set to continue. The name that is making headlines is Rachanok Intanon. The Thai sensation grabbed three of the four MetLife BWF World Super Series titles on offer so far, and in doing so, sped past Carolina Marin to the number one spot in the world rankings. But Rachanok is not the only player from Thailand at the summit. Thai players now occupy top positions at the junior level in men's singles and women's singles. The future certainly looks bright for Thailand with several young players doing well on the global scene. It is not easy to discover and develop talented athletes. But if we are looking back in the past few years, our system of developing young players has been working well which is shown in the World Junior Ranking. Now we have to focus on making them better and be competitive in the senior level. Not only are the Thai juniors number one in the singles discipline, what's also impressive is that there are three men's singles juniors from Thailand in the top six. Add to that, they have men's doubles in the top three, mixed doubles in the top four, and women's doubles in the top ten. Badminton Unlimited dropped by the National Training Center in the country's capital, Bangkok, to find out the secret of their juniors' rise to the top, a level traditionally dominated by China, Denmark and Indonesia. It is like a dream come true to be number one, because that has been my goal since I started playing badminton competitively at 15. It wasn't easy to get where I am now, so it is a reward for all the hard work. I was very happy when I found out. The achievement is all down to our determination to succeed and our hard work. I feel very proud. But more importantly, it is thanks to my parents who encourage me and they are always there for me and to my coach who helps me with the tough training every day. The determination, hard work and dedication to excellence will make her become a successful player in the senior level. One of the reasons that Thai badminton has been enjoying success on the international scene is the adoption of sports science into their training regime. Sports science has been integrated into the badminton programs of several countries for many years, but it's a relatively new development for Thailand. Something must be changed. Training is one of them, but there are a lot of elements to develop talented young players. For example, playing with other talents all the time, learning from great players, good game plan, better physical and mental condition. With the game getting more competitive, Tactics and technique have to go hand in hand with power and physical toughness. Apart from nutrition, psychology and game analysis, players are also put through intensive strength and conditioning to improve their on-court performances. A new fitness coach was brought in at the start of 2016 to beef up the team. I was disappointed in my results at the World Junior Championships last year and I knew I had to improve. So I kept training at the Badminton Association of Thailand. Because of the good training system provided by the association and together with the use of sports science, a good trainer and sparring partners, I'm now able to produce better results. At the Yonex German Junior that took place in March this year, Thailand walked away with gold and silver in the men's singles and a runner-up finish in women's singles. Wang Charon grabbed the gold in men's singles, while Cho Chu Wong took silver in the women's discipline. Since Rachanok's success in the World Junior Championships, Thai shuffles have been regularly making it to the winner's podium. Aldurak Namkul was the most recent medalist at last year's championships in Peru. The 18-year-old took home the bronze in the men's solo category. Since being part of the sports science program, I've seen improvement in my speed. I'm quicker now. I'm more alert on the court and able to better anticipate my opponents. 
my game is better and my physical condition has improved. Badminton in Thailand has always had a tradition of excellence, but Intanon's exploits have inspired the nation to a new level altogether. I want to win a gold medal at the World Junior Championships and do well in the Super Series tournaments. I also hope to be selected for the national team. My long-term goal is to get a gold medal at the 2020 Olympic Games. With its talented shuttlers hard at work and a team of dedicated support staff behind them, it will come as no surprise to see more Thai names on the winner's podium in the near future. One, two, three, three out! Five.